Welcome to Chemistry Tutorial 360. Today we are going to balance this reaction. This is sodium hydroxide, this is aluminium, this is aluminium hydroxide and this is sodium, right? Okay, to balance this reaction I can draw a table like this. On the left hand side or reactant side we have here one sodium. Here we have one oxygen and here we have one hydrogen. Here we have one aluminium, right? Okay. On the right hand side, we have one aluminium. Here we have three oxygen. Here we have three hydrogen. Here we have one sodium. Okay, now I will compare the number of uh, sodium first. So one one. So sodium is balanced now. And oxygen one and here three. So oxygen is not balanced. And hydrogen one three is not balanced. And aluminium one one. So it's not uh, aluminium is balanced. So hydrogen is not balanced. So to balance the hydrogen, I can multiply here by three that gives me 3 that is 3 3 hydrogen if I multiply here by 3 this 3 must come before uh, this uh, hydrogen that is uh, I will put here 3 if I put here 3 the number of sodium will be 3 right so I have to write the number of sodium here 3 the number of uh, oxygen will be changed so we are getting 3 oxygen here so let me write that and here we have three hydrogen all already we have that and aluminium one however now look at the number of uh, sodium here we have three but here we have one so to balance the sodium what should you do you can multiply here by three that gives you three these three must come before this sodium that is here so you have to put here three right so now look at the number of sodium so you have, you have 3, 3, oxygen 3, 3, hydrogen 3, 3, and aluminium 1, 1, right? Aluminium 1, 1. So you can say, say that this equation is balanced. But I will show you another way to balance this reaction, okay? Just let me write. Okay. You have here sodium hydroxide, right? okay let me write it here you have sodium hydroxide plus aluminium okay uh, this wedge right this wedge will go with this al so you are getting here aluminium trihydroxide this is three plus right one minus okay these three which must come from sodium hydroxide so here i can put three because sodium hydroxide has wedge right okay so and and we'll get sodium right and here we have three atom three molecule of sodium so i will put here three and this will be the balanced reaction you can just apply your common sense like the way that i have shown you so thanks for viewing this video be well